Let's look into the film. In this video, we will be looking at Romarius Ito Smith. He's five foot nine, 195 pounds, and we're going to look into some run concept. I believe that he is a north and south runner, one cut runner, by the way. Got a great deed of patience, run behind his blocks pretty well. He can catch out of the backfield, by the way. And he's so tiny. He shifts right inside and running in between the splits. Hey, I kind of like that because you got to have a certain type of mentality, right? And he exhibits that. Not saying that he's world class. Nevertheless, the system that he came out of from Atlanta, very similar, very similar to the Cowboys, especially running out of zone concepts, as well as running out of shotgun. You will see that in this particular clips that we chopped up here today. Now, granted, he may be small, but he packs a mighty good punch. Look how he gave the stiff form to number 54 and still move north. I love seeing that Cowboy Nation being able to. To still keep everything north and south and get the dirty yards here. This was a four yard gain. May not look so impressive, but he's so small that he can hide behind the offensive line and then swirt out there. And you will see that he get those multiple yards running north and south. One cut read and shifty enough. You can flex him inside the slot here. Watch he t pivots and turn and look back toward the ball. I like that Cowboy Nation. Know when to give that give up. He knows when to give up on a fight. He's not going to say, okay, I'm a macho guy. He goes down. And that's a very wise move of him. But in a pinch, if you need to get the dirty yards inside, he would do that. And then this is a good run, bouncing out to the outside here. I like this pickup, especially because of the fact that he can run out of shotgun. Got good vision, feet pretty well. A patient runner. Watch how he runs. Get up field. Being able to. To see the hole, hit the hole, and get up. That's what we like to see. Now, now he's so small. Watch how he's able to squeeze outside. Man, this man tried to take his arm off, huh? <laughs> Where the Mississippi love at, Abram? Come on now. <laughs> but out of this formation here, you'll see patient runner. Watch his block, get up field. Not afraid to just scoot. And then when he see the opening, he shoots through there like a, an explosion. Watch. 40 pick up his guy I love it patient enough to run through that alleyway there and keep his feet moving you see coaches all the time will tell him hey he earned this touchdown by keeping his feet moving they motion the guy keep the feet moving keep the feet moving north and south and watch everyone rallies around him they love it yeah yeah, they love it. And he earned that spot because he had to beat out Todd Gurley. He had to beat out Brian Hill. And the coach was like, hey, we're going to give you the opportunity to shine, right? Since everyone else didn't want to. And he exhibited that. Now, he's been bouncing around from team to team. He don't fit everybody's system, I, I must tell you. I think that he's a complimentary back. I think that he will be a good serviceable back that come off the bench or what have you in between times to give people spells but look at this play i love it because i i recall there was a running back similar to his size and statue that can do this hide behind the offensive line watch hide 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 squirt uh oh i got the ball <laughs> and not the fastest of the fastest but quick and so tiny look everybody's fooled everybody's biting the bait and not <laughs> Not paying attention to number 25. Yeah, he's so quick. And I'm not going to say the other person's name, by the way, because I don't want anybody saying that Law said that this is the reemergence of another guy by the last name of Smith that played for the Cowboys. But look at it. Get up field. <laughs> he's untouched, basically, until the safety 43 come down the field. I love it. Uh, it's just one of those things whereas you got a smaller running back that's not afraid to run in between the splits and get upfield and then he don't play around with his food one cut runner get upfield get the necessary yards he averaged five point i believe two yards in this game and we're just going north and south one cut i'm getting upfield I'm, I'm going to take what the opposition is trying to give and i'm gonna take it i'm just gonna take it can run out of shotgun that's very important the stop and go in between and the zone reads there <laughs> look follow his block follow his lead find a hole get the necessary yards get up field penetrate don't play around with your food see the hole open and patient enough squeeze off in inside and when you do that 
you are oh, you are able to change the impact of everything. Mm, watch this. Everybody filled in. Okay, we tired of this little dude running everywhere. Watch. We tired of him, man. He, we can't see him. We got to play discipline. Watch what this dude now. Play action is available. <laughs> Pass down the field. Why? Let's rewind. Let's look into this again. Watch. Pay attention to the linebackers in this situation. Watch. They are really. These guys right here are focusing on their halfback right here. Watch. Mm. Play action. Got the lead block up. Oh. <laughs> Everybody pulled in because they want to stop number 25, believe it or not. And they create open passing lanes for your quarterback to the receivers, which make everything comfortable. But you got to earn that Cowboy Nation. And by him being so small and they got to pay close attention to what he's doing. That's what he was able to do in that series there. He was killing them five yards here, six yards there. And that is what you are able to do when you're patient and you sit behind your blocks and you set up everything, foot placement, get there, set up your zones, set up your reads, and get upfield. And that is what he brings to the table. I like what he's doing. Um, he will be a good complimentary back. He's no Tony Pollard. He's no Ezekiel Elliott. And him and Corey Clements, they work and run similar, but I think – that he may be a little bit better as it relates to his patience runs or what have you. But it's good reinforcements to bring in somebody who, who just can get to that next level. Sneaking out of the backfield so small. Watch, he fakes out everybody on this one. They think that, hey, who got the ball? They don't know until they're like halfway down the field. Look, huh? Who got the ball? Oh, 25 got the ball. So I like that element of surprise. I like what he brings to the table in that fashion. Uh, Cowboys, he's on the practice squad. So I believe in the hearts of hearts, he's a guy that can fill into some of these voided spots. I look at the Cowboys utilizing him to see whether or not he can pick up the system. He's not the strongest in the world, nor the fastest. He can sneak inside. He can get upfield. He, he's an aggressive runner. I like what I'm able to see out of his tape. Let's see how the Cowboys utilize him in their particular system. And let's see what he can do from here, Cowboy Nation. Post me your thoughts. Post me your concerns down below. That's been my time. I really thank you all for yours. And remember, you're listening to nothing but the best. Go Cowboys.